Another treatment for spinal pain from degenerative disease is to treat the joints of the spine uh, with some form of injection treatment. Our, our protocols here are to start with the injection into the actual joint itself and at the same time the medicine gets uh, injected around the little nerves that go to the joint. So that's called the facet injection. You can see the needle going straight into the joint. In this case is a lower back. And we usually do three or four joints at the same time because it's hard to know, well, it's that one joint or that joint. So we, we typically cover all of the lower lumbar facet joints and the lumbar spine and in the neck the same thing. And the, the, the mid-lower cervical spine will typically do all of them on one side. If it helps, then we'll come back a couple weeks later and do the other side. With that treatment, if it works and lasts, if it lasts for months at a time, that's all we'll do. We'll just repeat that again. Uh, if you get nine months to a year or six months, then, then that's all we need to do is repeat that step. But if it lasts for a week or two and then comes back, then we go on to, to what's step two, which is the medial branch block. These are the little nerves that come and go to the joints and this is an example of a needle that's going to be injecting. In this case, what we're doing is just injecting uh, Novocaine or lidocaine around those nerves. We're not doing anything into the joint with the medial branch block. These are called the medial branches. Because it's just lidocaine, there's no chance that a medial branch block will give lasting relief. The blocking of those nerves will be a diagnostic test to see if you are a candidate for the burning of those little nerves with a needle probe called a rhizotomy. Step one and step two are merely indicators that step three, the burning of those little nerves, which typically lasts, those little, the little nerves that go to the joints, that innervate these joints, typically will grow back. They're not main nerves like the nerves that come out and go to your leg. These are just nerves that go to the joint and those typically will last and regrow over about nine months or a year. And you can see stage three in this diagram here, which is a needle hooked up to a, what's called a rhizotomy machine. And it is a thermocoagulation, meaning that needle is heated up and it, it just for a few seconds, but it's heated to a high temperature for a few seconds, and it actually coagulates or, or basically melts those little nerves. The needle's right here, so it's a, it's a safe distance away from the, the big nerve going down your leg or the sciatic branch under fluoroscopic guidance so you can get to these little branches without causing damage to the main nerve or any of the adjacent structures. 